What is up, everybody? <coughs> oh, jeez. <coughs> oh my gosh. Happy New Year. <laughs> um, I don't know if you can still hear my voice that I'm sick, but this whole past week I have been sick starting on Christmas, actually. And now it is New Year's. Um, yeah, I also haven't had a voice this whole week as well. So this is the first day that I feel like I can actually talk and people can understand me. I feel like my voice is still a little bit raspy, but it's at least not squeaking and sounding weird. So let's get into the resolutions. Actually, I really don't like resolutions. Just the whole idea of them, how like you have to get something done within this year or else like you're a failure. I just really don't like that because everyone does it every single year. They set a resolution and they usually have a couple and then by the end of the year they realize that they didn't accomplish it and so they see themselves as a failure because they didn't do what they said that they were going to do. So I just use this whole like season of setting goals as that, just setting goals. I basically just review the goals that I already have and revise them and then maybe add in some more. I think I actually do have like one or two that is like just for this whole next year I want to do this, but it's it's like things that like if I don't if I don't stick to it, it's not like I'm going to like see myself as a failure. Okay, so my first one, I actually am already doing it. Um, <laughs> I decided to actually do this about a month ago and I've actually been sticking to it besides this past week because it was Christmas, but that is posting two videos a week and I have actually been killing it. Also, I realized that ever since I like relaunched my channel back in June, it's been six months and I've actually been doing it. The only two weeks that I didn't post, it was because I was moving and like I literally could not post a video. Yeah, I'm really proud of myself. <laughs> and I was also looking back on some of my videos from the summer and they're actually cringe worthy. Oh my gosh, I was so uncomfortable. <coughs> I was so uncomfortable in front of the camera. Like it is painful to watch. Ugh. I really want to take some of them down, but I'm not going to because I like seeing the growth. On top of that, so I'm starting to do some like brainstorming, figuring out what I want my next adventure to be, and most likely I will be able to start posting daily vlogs. I'm saying that very hesitantly because I don't know 100% sure where my life is going in the next couple months. <clears throat> I am not 100% sure where my life is going in the next couple of months, so I can't say that that's like actually a goal of mine because I don't know if I can actually do that this year. When people come and check out my channel, I want them to be able to see who I am by looking at my channel, but also having all of these videos to be able to see my personality and who I am. They can see that I'm being real when I'm in front of the camera and yeah, they also just get to see like how I'm living my life, I guess. I don't know. I don't know, maybe this is a terrible idea. We'll find out. Next, I want to take my next step with dance. And again, this is very open-ended, <laughs> not specific at all. And I don't even know what it's going to be, but I just want to do something new and I want to challenge myself. Something that I've always wanted to do is actually build my own crew or company and that's a really hard thing to do but i really would love to do that because i think that i like being a choreographer more than i like being a dancer of course i love to dance but there's something about seeing people bring your choreography to life that just it's really cool to watch and just watching them make it their own and making it beautiful I don't know, It. Uh, I think it's like the teacher in me that's like, uh, I love it. I don't know, maybe this year I will go for that. I have no idea. I tried doing that in Utah last year. Wait, I'm really getting confused with my years now. When I lived in Utah, I tried doing this and it like kind of worked. It got me a job, but it didn't get me like my own company. So it was kind of, it was like, it wasn't a fail, but it wasn't a win either. 
But I think that's the cool part about this is that I'm just gonna keep going for it and failing and going for it and failing and going for it and failing until hopefully it will happen. But I don't know, if it doesn't happen, then it's just not meant to be. That's how I see it. <sighs> okay, <laughs> so I put down that I want to become a digital nomad, but of course that is not going to happen this year, but I want to really start working on that because I have expressed I think in like one of my videos this past month that I want to be an influencer and I want to be an entrepreneur. So I want to start brainstorming what I want my brand or company to be. Another thing that I really have always wanted to do is create an organization, something that brings people together to put good into the world. I just really want to start brainstorming those things and maybe even take that first step to making it happen. I don't know. It's kind of a scary thing to do this because I don't know. It's risky. It's not like a, a it's not something that brings a lot of comfort because it's a lot of risk taking and trusting yourself and your creativity. And that's something that I really want to challenge myself to do this year is trusting my creativity, trusting who I am and turning that into a brand. Yeah, let's do that. <laughs> next, I feel like I'm saying next a lot. I don't know what other words to use though. This is actually something that's going to be like just specific to one year. And that is taking a 10 second video of me freestyling every single day. So then at the end of the year, I can put it all together and then see a video of me freestyling every single day for this whole year. I just think it'll be really cool to see that. So, yep, that's something that I wanna do. <clears throat> and lastly, this is another one that is specific to just this year. And that is, I want to thrift all of my clothes and accessories and like stuff like that. I don't want to buy anything full price like at a mall or whatever. So when it comes to the clothes I'm wearing, the shoes that I'm wearing, any hats or accessories, jewelry, I want it to be from thrift stores or like markets that you find like on the street or whatever. I don't want it to be from any stores, I guess. Those are my goals for 2019. Honestly, I am really excited for 2019 because I have been reflecting on 2018 and I am honestly really happy with what 2018 brought. I grew so much and learned a lot of valuable life lessons in 2018 and I really started to take some risks in my life which I'm really proud of myself for doing. I have faced a lot of fears and I've conquered some of those. Some of them I am still afraid of, but that's okay. At least I'm, I'm facing them and I'm having the courage to do that. I just am so thankful for the people that have come into my life. Even if you were only in my life for like a couple days, you really did affect me and make a difference in my life. You helped me to continue to progress in learning more about me and what I wanna do with my life. So if you're watching this, and you have interacted with me in my life, then thank you. I am so excited to see what 2019 holds because I know, even though I do not have a plan at all, I have no idea where I'm gonna be in a couple months, like no idea, but I have so much confidence that wherever I end up, I know I'm gonna be happy and I'm gonna be challenged even more and just having to face probably some really weird things and there's probably going to be some more moments where I really am struggling and I'm so excited for those and I want to wish you guys a happy new year and please just don't be so hard on yourself with these resolutions I think it's ridiculous when people are so just enjoy life and just live your best life and be happy and no regrets man <laughs> All right, happy new year's guys and I will see you in my next video.